everyone. Welcome back to my channel. It is soon to be Dr. AKA EDU underscore curls here, also known as Nia. And as you can tell, my hair is straight. Um, this is different. It's new. It's a thing. And I'm actually excited to come to you guys and talk a little, a little bit to you about my hair straightening routine and then also be able to dive into how I bring it back to life after a workout. So first of all, if you're new here, welcome. I'm so glad to have you. Typically, we talk about curl content, skin content, beauty content, kind of those things under the sun, self-care, all of those things. Um, obviously, we're talking about straight hair today because my hair is straight, because it is the holiday weekend, um, and I decided to straighten my hair, just one, to trim it, and then two, to just see how long it's gotten, and I'm going to show you that today. Um, so yeah, welcome. If you are old here, welcome back. Love to see you. Love to have you. You all know that. Um, so today I'm going to dive in and talk to you a little bit about, uh, how I do this process. And then I'll talk a little bit about how I straightened my hair so you can see that across the video clip. All right. So stay tuned and I'll show you how I take this down. First of all, I use this wet band, um, when I'm working out, it's supposed to absorb the moisture in my hair. Um, and I leave it on probably a long time after my workout just to make sure it finishes absorbing, um, after my shower, etc., And that is really just as a chance for the, the moisture to be reabsorbed into this band. All right. So I'm going to take the band off and I'll show you what my hair is looking like right now. My scalp sweats very, like so much. <laughs> um, it sweats so much. And so my hair really curls back up. So what I'm going to show you today is how I use my ORAS heat protecting hair serum. Um, on my hair to then re take my round brush blow dryer and smooth my roots back out um, and then keep going. Um, I'm also going to mention this because about um, maybe three days into my straight hair, I will reuse uh, dry shampoo. And basically the way dry shampoo works is you take it, you section your hair, spray it on your scalp, like a little bit distant away, spray it on your scalp. I like take it, zhuzh it in, and then keep going. Um, so I'm gonna show you my process today for sectioning and taking my hair down, re-round brush blow drying so that you can see how it comes out. Um, and I'll show you that. And that's kind of all I do um, after my workouts is like re-dry my roots, re-smooth them, and call it a day. All right, so let's get into it. I'm gonna start by taking my scrunchie down. Whew. And you see the ends are not that bad. It's really my roots. So I'm going to section my hair out. Take about that much heat protecting serum. Put it back through my hair. And then start my round brush.
all. So you just got to see the clip. That was me kind of restraining my hair. What I'm gonna do from here is actually tie it back with my satin scarf, sit in my bonnet. Some of that will absorb some of the oil from my hair. Um, I will say that I can't get a ton of days of hair restraint because of how much I sweat. And you can already see how oily that like working out actually made my hair if you saw how wispy it was in day one, day two. Um, what I am gonna talk about is my process. So typically when I straighten my hair, I straighten to trim. Um, that is something I'm actually gonna do today. I'm gonna trim the ends of my hair. But when I straighten, I start with like doing my full wash routine where I deep condition and I shampoo and all that jazz. From there, I actually get out the shower and I go directly in with a heat protectant spray. Um, and I work that through in each section, braid or twist the sections up, um, and then kind of let it sit under a like a towel, a hair towel, or just let it dry. The other product that I've been using that I absolutely love is the Wow, the Color Wow Extra Strength Dream Coat, which has been just adding a level of sleekness to my straight hair that I absolutely love. That works really well for me. Um, my hair has gotten super, super long, so it's just really important that I can get a sleek style with one pass, two passes, and it'd be great. Um, and then the second or the third thing is the olive oil heat protectant hair serum, which I use after I blow dried. So I use these two before I blow dry. Um, and then I use this after I blow dry between my straightening. Um, I like to use the round brush blow dry that you guys watched me use. And then I use my FHI platform, um, FHI heat platform straightener. It's been really great to me for a lot of years and I just don't want a new one. Like it's fabulous. So those are, that's kind of like my process um, and what I do to go about it. When I sleep at night, I pull my hair into a satin scrunchie, um, which is actually what I'm getting ready to do now because I'm gonna sit with my hair um, in my bonnet and scarf. But I will take my satin scrunchie, I will pull my hair into a low ponytail, um, add a satin scrunchie, and then tie my hair down. And that's, Pretty much how I sleep, like that's it. There's no magical anything after that. Um, but that's like my straightening process and how I go. I'll probably go two to three days with my hair straight, um, or sorry, four to five days with my hair straight. I can go a lot longer when I don't work out, but I work out Monday through Friday and I'm not giving that up. So um, that's that. If it, if it becomes really bad after tomorrow, then I'll just wear it curly and call it a day. It's one of the reasons why I love wearing my hair curly so much. I don't have to deal with that because my hair just curls right back up. Um, but yeah, that's it. So thank you guys so much for tuning in and talking about my straight hair. I hope you got to enjoy it. I hope you really got to see a little bit more of like my technique and my approach. And I hope everyone has a blessed day. Bye guys.